the winner of the 2011 William Howard Taft Medal, has been called Mr. Ohio Pharmacist. He has worked in retail drugstores, in hospitals, and as an educator and lecturer. There is no more passionate advocate for the practice of pharmacy, and his innovations have had lasting impact on the profession. Today, due in part to his efforts, the pharmacist has become an easily accessible source of valuable information on medication therapy. J. Richard Wiest graduated from Cincinnati's Elder High School and earned three degrees from the University of Cincinnati, a BS in pharmacy, an MS in hospital pharmacy administration, and a doctor of pharmacy degree. After two years of active duty, four years as a training officer in the Air Force Reserve, and several years in retail and hospital pharmacies, Dick returned to UC as a professor beginning in 1967 and continuing until his retirement in 2001. The world of pharmacy changed dramatically during those years, and Dick Wiest was actively involved in just about every significant development. In earlier days, retail pharmacists were merchants, but Dick helped shape the state and national policies that transformed pharmacists into valued health professionals. As a member and two-time president of the Ohio Pharmacy Board, he championed the creation of a national standard for postgraduate continuing education that exists today. It's noteworthy that he was appointed to the board by both Democratic and Republican governors, John Gilligan and James Rhodes. He believed in experiential education and helped revise accreditation standards to include at least one year of full-time professional experience on site before graduation. Dick was a member of the National Association of Boards of Pharmacy Blue Ribbon Committee and worked with state pharmacy boards to ratify the first national licensure examination for pharmacists. He received the association's Distinguished Service Award for his efforts. And perhaps his most visible professional accomplishment is the development of the Pharmex labeling system for prescriptions. These brightly colored warning labels are used today on more than 4 billion prescription bottles. And Dick held a copyright for the Pharmex Drug Reference Center, which tells pharmacists which labels should be used for which medications. He co-authored a companion document, The Family Guide to Prescription Drugs. And the complete Pharmex label system has an honored place in the Smithsonian Institution archives. Achievements like these have made Dick Wiest a popular author and lecturer. He has written nearly 500 continuing education papers and more than 50 home study courses and has lectured nearly a thousand times. But Dr. Wiest never shortchanged his students and fellow faculty members at the University of Cincinnati. Over the years, Wiest sheets became valuable documentation for the more than 2,500 students he has taught. He received six Faculty Excellence Awards from his students, and his classes were legendary. And so was his sense of humor. After all, not every professor has his own bobblehead. So of course, when Dr. Wiest retired, there were testimonials and a roast. I've met a lot of people in this job as OPA exec, but when I met Dick Wiest in 1979, it's really no big deal. <clears throat> you don't want to be known by Dick Wiest. We graduated, I walked up to the podium to accept my license you know, at Columbus, and I figured, what can this guy do to me now? I passed the board. It's my chance to get even. And I said something quip, and he looks at me and he says, buy a suit that fits. <laughs> As he shakes my hand and gives me a license. I was that big, he was this big, he'll always be that big. Uh, the University of Cincinnati, College of Pharmacy, and frankly the entire profession of pharmacy has benefited for all these many years from your dedication, your commitment, uh, and frankly your good humor uh, in terms of educating uh, all of us as to how we make pharmaceutical care even a greater value for the patients we all serve. 
Dick Wiest remains active today as a professor emeritus in the College of Pharmacy and a member of its board of advisors. His passion for UC athletics is unrivaled and Dick and his family have followed the Bearcats all of his life attending both home and away games. Dean Daniel Acosta of the James L. Winkle College of Pharmacy says that Dick Wiest is truly beloved by his students because of his dedication and concern for their education and careers. Former student Mike Puccini, pharmacy business development manager for the Kroger Company, says Dick's influence has been and will continue to be a notable achievement. Ernest Boyd, executive director of the Ohio Pharmacist Association, notes that Dick has always strived to improve the profession and has taken the steps necessary to make an impact. For all these reasons, the University of Cincinnati Alumni Association is proud to honor Dr. J. Richard Wiest, pharmacist, teacher, and innovator, with its highest honor, the 2011 William Howard Taft Medal for Notable Achievement. <laughs>